today we are coming into Silverton. Woohoo! <laughs> Original Outback established in 
washed in a bit of a, a bit of um, uh, stunt driving. Yeah. I do turn in. The vehicles used in Mad Max. How cool. Oh, scared the hell out of me. <laughs> this is the bit we get. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I thought I was like, shit, I, I'm, I got it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> no, I thought, I'll use the says, anyone there? So I don't knock them over. Oh, no, it just scared the shit out of me. I heard your footsteps, that's the thing. <laughs> like, <laughs> Are these all the original cars? To, from these the. It'll tell you on if it's original. It'll, it'll have tell it, you, yeah, it'll written on. Yeah, I did yeah. say that. Yeah. Um, it's replicated if it's not got it written on. We've done them. Yeah. Done them still, cool. Yeah. So still awesome. It. Yeah. How unreal. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. So where it says. The actual, say, battery tray cover from the mat truck. But if it doesn't have a sign on it, yeah, it's a replica. There you go. How cool. That is actually a proper mat truck battery box cover. How funny. They've done it so well. How cool. Alright, in this part, you're not allowed to film in. So, see you bye. The front of the Mad Max 2 Museum. Halls of Justice. I'm gonna give you a squeeze. <laughs> there you go. Pretty cool. And they're actually filming another one. Gonna go see if we can get a look at the camp off in the distance, but probably won't. We'll try. So we're at the Mad Max Museum. And all these donkeys turned up. Random. Chasing away with your car. Hey, donkeys. Hello. <laughs> Ram the car. Ram the car. Ram the car. I wonder if I can get close and pet one. Hey donkey. Hey donkeys. Hey fella. You're alright. Hello. Hey. Hey Good day, neighbour. <laughs> Are we? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, hang on. I know that face. Come here for pets, donkey donks. So cute. It's craziness. It's a, it's a weird area, isn't it? I don't understand where they come from. <laughs> hey, Donk. Hey, Donk. Apparently, they will eat food. Hey. Oh, sorry. You alright? No. Oh, come here. Your ears. Nice. Hello. You can all come and get a little bit of pats, hey? 
The, the ears look oh, so soft. Oh. You your, your ears look so soft. Oh, they are. <laughs> they are so beautiful. soft. They are absolutely beautiful. Oh, donkey donk. Oh, you've made a best friend now. <laughs> Would you like a little... Hey? It's okay. You don't have to love me. Hey, there you go. Hey. How amazing. And random. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, if no, with no shoes on. Where are we off to, donkeys? We'll follow you. Hey. Hello. Hello. It's a donkey. Oh, I'm sure we. How cool. How cool. <laughs> Where are you going, eh? <laughs> Just think of the museum, sorry. <laughs> he said, I'm going over to the pier to get some food. There you go. Some random donkeys. Oh, he's scratching himself. <laughs> oh. Yeah. They just cruise around town. Yeah. <laughs> the donkeys are off walking through the main street of town. I'll show you them friendly donkeys and then we're going to go and see if we can find the filming area which will be so far off in the distance you probably won't be able to see it but we'll try yeah but they'll have a little camp there and here's the donkeys look at them so mama and her bubba and then the males are over there Excuse me, donkey. That will do, donkey, that will do. <laughs> yep, and mum's about to die because she's so cold. <laughs> Alrighty, off to the film set. That'll be 4,000 K away. We got our first glimpse of it. You can see it, it's just a huge white circus tent in the middle of nowhere. I'll show you out the window if you can see it. There. there you go, big tent city in the middle of the outback. We're gonna go to the reservoir. We might be able to get a better look at it, we'll see. There you go, you can see it, it's just a oh, way, 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 way long way from the road. So no one can hassle the Hemsworth. <laughs> there it is. There's a bit of dust, it looks like cars. I'm wondering if they're doing some filming at the moment. Can you see it? But we're at the reservoir. There's some tab data for you, some fun facts. There's the water. And there's the wall. Look at the size of that sucker. Let's go have a look. I'll leave Nana in the car because she's freezing at the moment. Check it out. That's cool. There you go. 
we're overlooking now the Mundy Mundy Plains and if when I pan across you can see that that is Mad Max film set through area I wonder how close you can actually get because it doesn't say you can't drive along this road here where those cars are heading up and I don't know if that comes around you'd get pretty darn close kind of almost want to try but at the same time I really just couldn't be asked yeah you can actually see where they're filming it from about a thousand kilometers away pretty cool and then the Mundy Mundy Plains it's just beautiful it is stunning out here I'm absolutely loving this outback scenery it is just beautiful and it just gets better and better there are some cracking spots I'm really enjoying it should we try should we go that way and see we'll see how we go pardon Mum wants to go home because she's dying a slow, painful, horrible death. And to be honest, me too, because I have to listen to it. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We're doing it. We're seeing how far we can get or how close we can get before we turn around or shot. <laughs> or run out of fuel and get stuck in the outback. It so is. I don't know. You do. Security. Security. They could be filming a um, documentary on goats because it's goat ranch farm. Yeah, true. Could be the Ringling Brothers Circus practicing for their next tour. Yeah, well, well, it does look circusy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but that's Hollywood, isn't it, though? Well, I have no idea. Ah, <laughs> so would have oh, said no if it was. was. Say we saw them. Yes. Yeah. Yes, you can. I can't. Thank you. <laughs> have a nice day. Haha, <laughs> that's so it. I knew it. You want to go to me? You don't want to go to the wind farm, do you? Yeah. No. Oh, why not? We're here. Ooh. That's it. We had unconfirmed. Oh, I guess confirmed that it was that. There's a non-security guard at the gate she might be laughing with no ID asking if we're having a sticky beak but couldn't confirm or deny that that's exactly where they're filming Mad oh, Max. That's a big one. Yep. And it also says unit base. It's a hundred percent in. And no mum, it's not the army because the army is camouflage. <laughs> well, <laughs> When, you bloody idiot. When this show comes out, I'll most probably tell everybody where it was for. So you're right there. That's
that's where it was filmed. Hello, little baby. That's the non-security people. For the goat documentary that they're not filming. Here it is. This is how close you can actually get to it. or a goat documentary. You got pretty damn close. <laughs> Didn't think we'd get that close, eh? No. I thought they would have it blocked off near the reservoir. I didn't think you'd be able to even come out here. But you can. And we did. Heading to the wind farm and you can see the big tent set up right in front of us. But for now, we're on an adventure. Hope we don't have to come all the way. <laughs> yeah, we do. <laughs> and we're just taking some random roads to check out these big wind turbines. Wow. You know they're big, but the closer you get, they're bloody big. You can hear it. Holy moly, that whole thing is moving. The wind farm. And the beautiful view from the top of the hill. Looking out over the Monday Monday plains. Listen to it. Wow. 
check it out. This is beautiful up here, windy, so that's why they have the wind farm. Wow. I've never been this close to one and to hear it, that's awesome. What a that's concerning. That's a horrible sound. That would scare the shit out of you. You'd think it's falling, right? It's not. It'd scare the shit out of me. All right, I'm gonna go photo for mum and get out of here because that scared me. It's gonna fall on us, we're all gonna die. Just so I can say I've touched one. All right, now I'm leaving in case the whole bloody thing comes down on top of us. Hey guys, I'm hiding behind the car because it is blowing its tits off at the moment. Yesterday we drove from Mildura through to Albury so I could watch basketball. And I finally got to meet Lauren Jackson. That's a story for another time, however. But along the way, I saw this random gate just in the middle of nowhere on the side of the road called the Blue Gate. And the whole drive today from Albury and we're going to Bell Reynolds, I've been staring at the side of the road essentially trying to find this gate. Excuse the wind noise because yeah, it is blowing. Anyway, check it out. Like when I say it's in the middle of nowhere. Oh, hello. It's in the middle of nowhere. Check it out. Like this is where we are on the side of the road. It is in the middle of nowhere. Just pause your screens and have a read of that. But it's symbolic of the original gate that stood in the area in the 1800s and it was pretty much a Cobb & Co thing. But check it out. Just on the side of the road, middle of nowhere. I found it! I am so stoked. I've been looking for hours. And I was thinking, oh, we've driven past it. But in my head, I'm like, no, if I don't just keep searching, I'll be pretty pissed if we drove past it. And then all of a sudden here it was. And I found it. I'm gonna touch it, touch the gate. Yeehoo, so stoked. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Woo! Now I can drive peacefully the rest of the way through to Bow Reynolds, which is like an hour away. Yes. Now that I'm out of the wind, I'll give you a little bit more info on the Blue Gate. Like I said, it's a replica or a node to the original that was there in the 1800s. And this vicinity is reputed to be the last known area that the headless horseman was sighted. There you have it. Little bit of Australian folklore there for you. And a random blue gate in the middle of bum nowhere. All right, we're off to Bell Reynolds now. I found my gate. <laughs> yes!